Hi guys and welcome back. So today's video is going to be a bit of a different one from me. I'm going to produce some more content for YouTube whilst I'm at university and I thought I would show you some more university content because I've never done that kind of thing before and I think it could be quite interesting um, to see. This video is going to be in like two parts. I'm going to put two different sort of videos together in this one. Um, so firstly you're going to see a kind of packing with me for university and then the second half is going to be a kind of realistic uni room tour. My room isn't Instagram worthy by any means and it's not going to be like picture perfect all the time and I basically have just literally just gone around and quickly like tidy things up and put things away so it doesn't look as messy. I moved to uni two weeks today as I'm filming this. Um, I moved to uni on the 24th of September um, and start like induction 28th of September. Um, in terms of that's a week later and I've already kind of packed up some of the bits and pieces in my room um, and I'm just going to show you basically what I've packed so far so let's actually have a little look at what I've already got so far and I'm going to repack this bag because there's just way too much stuff in here and it's actually getting a bit heavy and I bought new pans and stuff so that will kind of needs to get packed uh, but I thought I'd just give you a little look into what's in my backpack I just kind of have like a couple of notebooks in here planners some details stuff um pencil case it's got loads of pens and highlighters and stuff in it now i mentioned like i bought some new saucepans so i bought a 16 centimeter and a 20 centimeter saucepan and um, i basically wanted like a smallish saucepan that i know i could easily quite cook pasta in like pasta for one and then a bigger one that i can put like batch cook some like spaghetti bolognese or chili or this bag is absolutely chock-a-block full of stuff. Like, I've got Tupperware in there, I've got like a glass jug here, I've got baking stuff because I'm a keen baker, um, frying pan, Nesquik, the essentials. I basically just kind of need to go through and reorganise this and repack it. So I have a spare Ikea bag here, which I'm going to repack for you. In this bag here I basically just have bits and pieces. Um, I've got some female hygiene products at the bottom in a tub and then on top I've basically just got like loads of different things. It's mainly kind of just like um cold and flu stuff and just like a mini first aid kit just to be prepared for the winter and here's just kind of like a mixture of headbands i've got fairy lights i've got little bits of decorations and like other bits and pieces that are just really really random so this is everything that i'm taking to uni so in here i basically just have like a bag of like beauty stuff and toiletries i have like a bathroom bin i also have my light in there as well um another necessity for this year disinfectant spray so that'll be one of the very first things i will do when i get to my uni room so that's kind of all in there a couple of pairs of boots that's the kitchen bag that i just packed this one is very similar um this is basically all of my like plates and bowls tupperware um, kitchen utensils, toilet roll, um, it's kind of all of that stuff that's in there, nothing super exciting. Um, this bag here is mainly cleaning stuff, clothes era, um, I have a suitcase, this is mainly kind of clothes, the big one's mainly full of clothes as well, um, that's all clothes, that's mainly clothes. This is just a bag of food out of the cupboard that my mum's given me, stuff to use up, bag of shoes, this is just like a bag of bits and pieces, so I've got like hairbands in there, fairy lights. Um, these sticks are for my laundry bag. Um, I also have a rug under there. I have a box of bedding and towels and stuff in there, down there as well, as well as my computer monitor screen. But I'm not going to pull everything out because it's just a mess and I can't really be bothered. Um, I've got my backpack, which has got loads of my books in, um, as well as bits and pieces from room. I'm just trying to cram everything into as little sort of bags and stuff as much as possible because I'm having a higher car I need to make sure that I can fit everything in the car so I'm trying to limit like the amount of stuff that I'm taking with me so I'm gonna go and show you my room 
So as you walk into my room, this is what you see. So I'm currently standing by my door. So you guys can get like the full kind of picture. Um, so this is my uni room. So as you come in, you've got amazing storage right by the door. So in this kind of bottom cubby, I've put my suitcases, suitcases in there um, and it's like the perfect size for them. In this section, this box contains all of my bedding and my towels and flannels and stuff. Good place to put them and it kind of keeps them kind of clean and tidy because obviously it's all zipped in so you can't get dirty. And then this box is literally just a box of like random bits of food and stuff that I'm not really using on a regular basis. Um, and I don't really have a huge amount of room for this in my kitchen cupboards. This is also leftover like kitchen stuff so there's like extra bowls and tupperware and like a jug and other bits and like baking pieces i can't fit in and a couple of bags and then up there is just bags um then you've got my wardrobe so my wardrobe is quite big so in here you just have got space at the top for like any storage then i've got my clothes Got my underwear in there, shoes in the bottom bit. And then in the drawers I just have all my clothes. So in this section I've actually just got tops and pyjamas. Um, I have all my white tops together because I actually have quite a few. So that's what they are. And then regular t-shirts and then long sleeve t-shirts because winter and pyjamas. I've got jumpers, hoodies, gym wear and then like jeans and joggy bottoms. To the right of me you've got my bathroom so on the back of my bathroom door I've got my coat rack so my bathroom's quite small um so you've obviously got like toilet got a couple of cleaning products down there and like toilet brush and stuff extra toilet roll here is just kind of this very simple kind of selection of like stuff that I need in the bathroom towel and cloths another towel rack there um I just have my bin down there then on here I just have like my toothbrushes and toothpaste razor soap thing for my retainer um, and then my shower which I actually used this morning. So this is the rest of my room. So here I've got like a kind of two shelf kind of bookshelf kind of stand thing. Um, so on the bottom I've just got like my extra beauty stuff, hair dryer, straighteners, toothbrush charger. This kind of bit is quite messy. Um, it doesn't always look quite so messy um, but I've just got like my makeup bag and stuff, um, skincare bits and pieces and just other little random pieces um, and hairbrushes and perfume and stuff. And then here I've just got like tissues, makeup brushes, cotton pads, my diffuser, light clock and then just a little thing for my rings and the leftover drink. Um, so I've also got a nice big mirror here which is super super handy. Then obviously I've got my bed, I've got my Eeyore from Disney, I've got my fairy lights. This gorgeous bedding set, um, big jungle theme. I bought this from Asda last year, so Georgia Asda um, bought that from. The throw and the grey pillows, they're from Primark. Down here I've got my Era, which I just picked up in Argos for like £12-£15. My laundry basket, which says laundry today or naked tomorrow, I picked that up in Dunelm. Um, before I moved um, in here I've got some pegs that I sometimes hang like socks and stuff off uh, I've got my yoga mat and my badminton racket um, my backpack which I haven't actually used yet because we're all online so this is the view from my room so I'm quite fortunate that my room looks out on the back of the student accommodation so along here is my desk very fortunate to have a ginormous desk and it's so handy um, so we'll start back up here. So I've got my little palm that I had at home, just brought it back up with me just to give a bit of life into my room. Picked up this gorgeous smelling reed diffuser from TK Maxx and I've got these three drawers and my like bin. So in this top drawer I've basically got kind of stationery, got a spare notebook, blue tack, scissors, drawing pins, tape, stapler, that kind of thing, um, camera charger 
all that fun stuff. Now these next two drawers will probably be a little bit more messy because I don't tend to go in them as much. Um, but in here I've just got random bits and pieces. I've got like hair bands, my like camera tripod, my Fitbit, cables. Uh, I've got like laundry balls and like flashcards. So just, this is kind of like my junk drawer. Good old packet of ice gems, um, like rest over hair bands and important documents. That's kind of where they stay. Then up here, this is just all cleaning stuff. Um, nice big bottle of Zaflora. I've got like anti back spray. Um, I've got like wipes. I've got an entire box of cleaning stuff and sponges and all different sorts of things in there. Up here, I haven't really got that much. I think there's just like a dust on a hot water bottle. This shelf, not really much going on, a little bit messy. Have a few books, a couple of my cookbooks, some birthday candles. My keys, a couple of face masks, because obviously, you know, in the middle of a pandemic. An oat bar thing that we were given and not even eaten yet. Little, like, fake flowers that I picked up from Wilco's. Hairbands and clips. Little packet Haribo's. Smirin off. And a couple of wine glasses. My desk area, where I spend a lot of time at the minute, because all online classes, woohoo. Um, so I've got my notebook that I've been writing notes down in. My academic planner. I also have this desk planner which I picked up from Paper Chase. Um, so it's just kind of a week to view. Um, got a dinner planner to do this priorities habit tracker. It's got little um, water drop. It's kind of hard to see on here, but you can take off how many glasses of water you've drank. This is just a kind of a peel off version. Um, so I use my academic planner as well with my desk planner. My pin board just has a few different things on there, like my SAS letter. Um, and the, like post-it things and then my like, little whiteboard where I just put a couple of things up on there. I've got my Google Nest Mini, I've got my computer monitor and my laptop and then my little desk kind of organizer where I've just got notebooks and pens and highlighters and pencil case and this is my room. <laughs>